hi friends do you want to then display the username in login so what you have to do open the run menu and enter the command sakepol.msc it says sakepol.msc and uh, one group policy wizard will be common, uh, open okay so what you have to be do you have to be just uh, navigate to the local policies then security options double click on the security options in right pen side you have to be search for the interactive login and do not display user last username and password okay this one you have to be select do not this by default it's a disabled what you have to be do you have to be just enable this one apply and okay and close this wizard after that open the command from as admin okay and then after you have to be enter the command and here enter the command gp update slash force okay so it will be update the policies in your windows 10 pc okay if you now log out from this account okay whatever account you log in if you now log in uh, with this account okay so as you see here now it's asking for press ctrl alt plus to delete and now you have to be enter the username as you see here now your old uh, users are not showing here means now you have to just enter your new username and password you can do this job also with the registry open the run menu and enter the command reg edit okay and in registry actually uh, group policies for the mostly uh, home, not for home edition if you have home edition you can also do with the registry editor to same job you can do with uh, registry editor so what you have to be do you have to be just navigate to hkey local machine software microsoft then windows okay go for windows search for windows okay then select the current version okay in current version you have to be select for the policies you have to be search for in current version you have to be select for search for policies go up you have here policies in policies double click and double click on the system menu okay in system menu you have option last do not display last username okay so as you seen here now it's a one by default it's a zero you have to be change this one to one because i enable the group policy and group policy change this value to zero to one so you have to make this one to one okay if you are doing the with the registry editor so in this way you are able to do this job okay and windows will be not shown to you your last username and password so hope you like my videos please subscribe thanks thanks for watching